Kayla. Welcome back to my channel. Today we're doing another snack crate video with special guests. My dad and my sister. You can say hi. Hi. Hello. Hi. Okay. We have no idea what country we got, so we're excited. Are you guys ready? Yeah. <laughs> Let's is, do it. This is so awkward. I hope it's a good one. Oh, we got the UK today. She loves, what's it, Doctor Who? Yes. Who? That's, oh, he's so funny. So funny. Pretty much, they just give us a bunch of snacks from the UK and we get to try them. So, it also gives us some fun facts. Approximately 165 million cups of tea are consumed every day in the UK. At one point, the British Empire ruled approximately 25% of the world's population and covered about 25% of Earth's total land area. The accent of people from the UK changes noticeably every 25 miles. That's interesting. No portrait was ever painted of William Shakespeare when he was alive. And nowhere in the UK is more than 75 miles from the sea. It's pretty cool. They got a lot of fancy different kinds of Skittles. So the first snack we have is Skips. It yes. is a light and melty prawn cocktail. And we can also win and get active. We can win a cash prize if we enter this. Bats and balls to be won. Bats and balls to be won. <laughs> All right. How's it smell? Good. It smells kind of good. Cheers. 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 Cheerio. I don't like it. <laughs> it kind of tastes mm. like a porta potty smell. Like, it tastes like what a porta potty smells like in my opinion. Yeah, porta potty. Oh! What do you guys think? I like them. Yeah, no. What's next? Space Raiders. Spicy Space. flavor cosmic corn snacks. So I'm noticing that the UK likes their corn snacks. It smells like chili. But they're in the shape Ooh. of a skull. So spicy, yeah. They smell like chili. I don't really like spicy stuff. I'm a whiskey. And they're little aliens. <laughs> they're little aliens. <laughs> Okay, you ready? Cheers. <laughs> Better, but they're not very flavorful. I don't do well with spice, but they're not really spicy. But I kind of like them. I like them. Those aren't bad. They're really boring. Okay. Next, we have hula hoops. Hula hoops. It's puffed grilled beef flavored wheat and potato rings. Wait, what? That sounds disgusting. <laughs> You guys remember how I said that I am very uncultured and I have extremely Caucasian taste buds? Welcome to where I got it from. Ooh. It smells it like smell a whole butter? dinner. It literally smells like dinner. <laughs> I kind of think I'm gonna like it. But again, it's like corn, corn flaky. They're very corny. <laughs> okay, cheers. Whoa, that's a lot of flavor. I feel like I just am not like a corn snack person because you get so much flavor and then it's just like, I'm not a big fan. They're not horrible. Like they're I wouldn't horrible. spit it out, but I yeah. wouldn't eat these. All right. I would. All right. Now what we we got a drink. Urn Brew, original and best. Scan your can. I hope that this is like an orange pop. I know Alyssa Thank is you. gonna be the hard critic because she likes orange pop a lot. All right, cheers. 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 Actual cheers this time. This is very sweet. And it almost tastes like Diet Fago. Like it has a really weird aftertaste. It tastes like orange jello with carbonation. Yeah. That's a good, that's a good one. I like it. I just don't like the aftertaste. I think it would be better to put it in the fridge. It went away. Okay. All right, what's next? Jaffa cakes. Jaffa cakes. I'm a little disappointed in UK snacks. Come on, Michaela. Open that thing. Okay. Oh, there's exactly three in here. I don't think I'm gonna like this just based off the smell. Cheers. Cheers. Oh, never mind. I like this. It's got some orange. It's chocolate orange jelly. That's a good one. I really like that one. And this is the tiny tasty chewy sweets, millions, strawberry. Okay, ready? Cheers. Cheers. <laughs> <This is laughs> One, two, three. Oh, those are harder than I expected, but they're good. Very strawberry. Those taste like, uh, what is it, Laffy Taffy. Those aren't bad. That's good. That's pretty good. Sherbet fountain. Sherbet, sherbet. Sherbet. It's a licorice dip. Wait, what? Twist to open. Mm -hmm. Shoot. <laughs> I'm gonna fart, I'm squeezing so hard. <laughs> okay, got it. What? <laughs> it's gonna get messy. And that's where they put the cocaine. <laughs> I don't 
think you're supposed to eat that. It's licorice. I'll pass. You can't pass. That's against the rules. You have to take a bite. Of what? This is... <laughs> UK. Okay, can someone from the UK explain to me what the shit this is? Because, listen, no. <laughs> I don't think we ate this correctly. I don't think so. So we're probably the stupid ones. It's not a problem. We are the stupid ones. But what is this? <laughs> okay. <laughs> double decker. Ooh, Cadbury double decker. I love Cadbury chocolate so you much. You can't go wrong with oh, Cadbury. I'm waiting for this one. This? this? Chewy. <gasps> nougat? You're going to love this. So Guys, it's nougat look. and... So All right, ready? This has potential. Three, two, one. Mmm, this is really good. I'm eating the whole thing. This might be my favorite thing. Yeah, this is giving that the licorice a run for its money. I also just don't like licorice, period. Next up, we have a flake. It's the crumbliest, flakiest milk chocolate. Oh, wow, this looks mm. kind of cool. It's quite literally flaky. Mm. Like, look at this. It's gonna be messy. Yeah, the UK has a lot of messy snacks. All right. One, two, three. <laughs> okay, this chocolate's not bad when it's like gone. The aftertaste is good. But it just tastes like chocolate that's been sitting out for years. It's like chalky, like it's like a stale. How do you how do you give us chocolate like this in the same box as Cadbury chocolate? I don't get it. I like this. It's Cadbury from the UK. That's so, Cadbury this chocolate. Is Cadbury too. How did Cadbury fumble the bag like that? Wow. Randoms. Randoms. I have a llama on it. Ooh, llama. Hmm. All right. I already ate it. <laughs> Typical gummy. I mean, I guess it just stuff. depends on the flavor you get. So what do we got? One more thing? I Calling your horses, man. I still can't believe this is Cadbury chocolate. It's just not good. Crun ah, oh, I've more? had crunchies before. I've had those from Canada. Is this Canada. like those sea foam? Are, huh? Is this like sea foam? Those are good. Wait, is it like is sea foam? Kind of, yeah. Oh, oh, I love sea good. foam. It's Cadbury. Oh my God, I'm excited to try this. Let's save this one for last because there's two more. Oh, there's Cadbury fudge. Okay, so to answer my question, Cadbury most definitely is from the Yeah. I always get the Cadbury um, Easter eggs with the chocolate. Those were always my favorite candies as a kid. Fudge, but it's not like fudge. I'm confused. Mm. Cheers. Cheers. All right. Cheers. <laughs> yeah. And that's not my cup of tea. I don't like the filling. What kind of filling is it? It is fudge. It's like vanilla fudge. So it's not bad. Not bad. Sour apple chews extreme. We got a little alligator on it. It's a chew it. Get it? Because alligators are. Smells but it's good. really soft. It like. Ooh. Okay, let's eat it. Okay, she's already eating it. And this is the kind of candy that I feel like UK grandmas probably have at their house. This is definitely a grandma candy. So here's a crunchy. My dad said he's tried these before. Oh yeah, those are good. We love chocolate covered sea foam. Yeah, we love sea foam. So hopefully this is that. Oh, yeah, oh like yay, yay, this has made my day. I'm gonna have to order a bunch of these. Okay, just go ahead, eat it. This is like ASMR, ready? Oh yeah. oh yeah, the UK has chocolate that is undefeatable. All right guys, I think the crunchy is definitely in first place in my opinion, followed by the double decker, and then this chocolate orange Jaffa cake. What was your favorite? Definitely the crunchy. I can't really decide. All I can say is this one was my least favorite. Yeah, that was disgusting. Double decker was really good. Out of the chips or the puffs or whatever you call them, these are probably Okay. Hey Alyssa, how was that piece of candy you just had? She just tried a chunk of that white stuff. It was like right there and I'm like, oh. Dad, take a bite. Uh, no. Please. No. Take a bite, take a bite, take a bite. <laughs> I took the bigger one than that. <laughs> oh, and it's like kind of fizzy like, oh God. <laughs> If you're from the UK, what is this? Please comment below because I need to know. I know we're doing this wrong. How is this supposed to be done? And do you guys actually like this? All right, guys, this is it for the Snack Crate unboxing. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. I feel like this was definitely not what I was expecting at all. It was either extremely bad or extremely good. There wasn't really an in-between with this box, which is interesting. What do you think, Dad? Crunchies, you can't go wrong with crunchies. I've had those before. Giving us the delicious. review again. <laughs> These things, I don't know. Not a Dorito. Alyssa? I want to go to the UK. I do too, but I think I might bring some of my own snacks with me. All right, guys. Thank you so much for watching. Until next time, don't forget to like and subscribe. Bye. Take care
on myself, no, I don't need that 